nouns are here and they're coming into PGL Wolekia season one. I've got Fly sitting with me. First of all, you're looking good. You're looking well rested. So how are you feeling? I I'm doing good. You know, I was able to you know, sleep off the jet lag a little bit and yeah, feeling good. And you even went gym this morning as well, so positive routine. Yes. Everything's all looking very nice. Yeah, yeah. It's, a, it's a good way to get over jet lag as well. You know, make yourself tired, uh, start your day right, you know. It's, it's my, I'm definitely a routine kind of guy. Nice, and that experience is shining through. I want to talk about your journey to qualifying for this event because you were invited to the NA qualifier, and rightly so, you dominated, but it, well, I guess it's just what you expected, right? It's like anything else would have been seen as a massive failure. For sure. Uh, I mean, it's no, you know, everybody knows that NA scene is, is weak. It's weaker compared to everyone else. Uh, and because Shopify was invited to this tournament, then, yeah, basically there was nobody who was nearly as good as them in the qualifier. So uh, I'd say it was fairly easy. Um, but yeah, that's just NA scene for you. <laughs> Some things, it's like a positive, right? Because you can make it through, but then obviously a bit harder when you're looking at what can competition drive you mm. on than when you get to here. And for you guys, you mentioned already about what happens in North America, and it's been a story for quite some time now mm -hmm. in terms of what you guys can look at in achievements and what you want to do. How do you look at it right now in terms of what you can achieve here and or kind of what goals you set? So obviously we're not under any illusions. We're coming in as underdogs to this tournament. Uh, we haven't had the best results and that's all fine. Uh, I think the biggest thing for us is to show some kind of progression. Okay. So we recently picked up a new coach and we've been working with him a little bit before this event. Um, so we're just, we just want to do it one step at a time. Ideally, you know, we want to be able to get out of a groups because last tournament we lost in groups. Mm -hmm. uh, so that will be the first step. And if we manage to do that, then we'll take it further. Uh, so yeah, just, you know, take it as it goes. And in terms of looking at you as an individual, you have experience, right? But would you still feel pressure given the situation you're in right now? Do you still feel like, okay, look, we need to have the success? I'd say I don't really feel that way. At least I don't want to project that onto anybody else because I think that will put you in like a bad mental space. Um, like I said, the, the key here is to have realistic goals. Mm -hmm. And we all, we are all aware of where we're at as a team. We're not nearly as good as, you know, the top teams like whatever, Falcons or something. We are aware that we're not at that level, but if we can just make ourselves 1% better every day, we might be able to get there. Yeah. So Dodo is a game about learning constantly. Like you, you just, you learn or you die. <laughs> uh, and we're pretty much at the stage in Dota where every single role has to be very good individually at what they need to do. So, you know, years ago it would be like position five, you would just run around with boots and wards and, you know, hopefully you get your ward out before you die. Uh, we're no longer like that anymore. Um, every single role needs to sort of scale into the game and be able to use their abilities, use their timings. And I'm a, I'm a key part of that. So I'm able to be, to focus on myself more, for sure. Perfect. Thank you very much, man. Yeah. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you.